Wow, Dune Prophecy. This looks good. I love... Okay, first of all, I think this looks like Game of Thrones in terms of drama, drama and the four factions. It looks like we're going to have four different planets fighting for power. Game of Thrones, if you've seen it, you understand what I'm talking about. A lot of drama. And for, and for me, one of the most... Two of the most important things that I've seen in this show that got me excited is one, a very defined look a very defined visual language in terms of the crafts in terms of the architecture and in terms of the costumes they look like these are people who know what they are doing and they borrow a lot from denise Villanue, who was very specific about the look and the architecture and basically the visual style of these movies the other thing the cinematography complements the you know the costumes complements all the set designs and the again interior language of each planet because they look like you know, concepts that we've never seen before uh, the, the, there's a sense of style in how the shots have been captured i really like the way it looks like i, I that got me excited the cinematography got me absolutely excited the, the ships don't look like what we're used to in terms of starships now if there was anything that i had a problem with number one would be like this falls in place with the modern shows in, in, in 2020 and in the 2020s and the late 2090s whereby yes you have Dune which worked and had a male lead and now let's do it for the women let's have a female centric show I'm not I don't have anything wrong with female characters this time it makes sense for it to be set female centric because it follows those ladies who would put something on you to make sure you is it called ganjaban or something that it makes sense for us to follow them because they were really really they were an interesting community and i've always wondered how they acted and you got to get a you know just a bit a taste of that with the movies and i like the fact that you're going to see where it all began my biggest fear is that we might go all ring of power thing whereby they become so female centric that it feels like it, 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 it's pandering to a trend which is serving the minority i i wouldn't want for it to feel that way i would i would like i would wish for them to be as neutral as denise Velanu movies whereby it, it's really not about the danger it's really it's really not about the gender it's more or less about the characters and what the characters are doing in relation to the story are they serving the story i would hope that is what you're going to get but generally visually and the you know this seems like max doing a game of throne or doing uh a ring of power or doing uh house of dragon but based on dune because there's that sense i like the fact that we don't have we're not going to be only on one arrakis we're going to be on different planets and you're going to see different characters in terms of their cultures so dune prophecy looks very good distinct uh, fantastic cinematography please let this be good anyway thanks for watching this please subscribe so that we can do this again and uh, for those who are watching this who have subscribed to my channel who are my followers and my fans thanks for actually being here you're the reason that I actually will stop what I'm doing to actually make a video it feels good to know that there are people out there who actually appreciate your stuff so thanks for watching this have a great night have a great day wherever you are